this is Dave Gardner with Keller Williams Realty, and I'm here today with Linda Ludeen of Castle Rock Dental Health for an interview uh, about her dental practice for the Park Bench website of LarksburgColorado.com. How are you doing, Linda? Good, thanks. How are you doing? Excellent. Good. So tell us a little bit about your Castle Rock Dental Health practice. Well, so Castle Rock Dental Health is a general dentistry practice. Uh, we, we strive to give our patients optimal dental health, and we try and make them see the connection between dental health and overall health. And as far as the practice here, we've been here about 20 years. Myself, I've been fortunate enough to be here about five years. Well, excellent, excellent. Now, you just joined the Larkspur Chamber of Commerce recently, correct? That's right, yes. Yeah, yes. so you're uh, looking to take on some new patients from the Larkspur area. Yes, and we do actually have some patients from the Larkspur area, and one of our staff members is actually from Larkspur. Oh, that's excellent. Well, tell us a little bit about your staff and your team members. Well, uh, when you first walk in the door, uh, Heidi is the happy, welcoming face that's going to greet you there. Um, she is our office manager, and she's usually the first person that you'll have contact with when you make appointments and so forth. Um, Heidi has about 20 years of experience in the dental field. Wow. Um, she's been with us, luckily, for about three years. We've been so thankful to have her. She is a wizard with insurance. If you have any problems with insurance, she can take care of it for you, and she is on your side. Then we have Sarah, who's my assistant. Uh, she has about seven years of dental experience, been with, with me about five years. Um, I rely on her for everything. She's the one that will greet you in the waiting room, bring you back to the chair, explain the procedure, uh, answer any questions you might have, and just try and make you feel comfortable. Teresa is our longstanding hygienist. Uh, she's been with the practice almost 20 years. Wow. And a lot of our patients actually come here just to see her. So we so appreciate that she's here. We appreciate that longevity. Um, we also have one other uh, hygienist who's Marie. She's been here about a year and a half, also with 20 plus years of experience. So well, we all have longevity. And now that I think about it, we have probably over almost 100 years of experience between and among us. So. Right. Well, you've been the owner uh, of the company about five years. That's correct. Where were you before? I was in a, an associate in a, a practice in Cherry Creek downtown ah, okay. for about 10 years. Um, uh, and then I decided I could strike out on my own at this advanced age. So here I am. Uh, prior to that associateship, I was in public health. Right. Well, what made you decide to open a business in Castle Rock? You know, there, there are a few reasons. Um, you know, when I first saw the practice, it was well set up. It had, had good equipment. Uh, we did add a few upgrades. Um, I love the space. There's plenty of space here. There's four chairs, which is exactly what I needed. Um, uh, also, the location, clearly. We're right here at the foot of Castle Rock. So right. you get your cleaning. You can go walk up Castle Rock. It takes 15 minutes to get to the top. Um, and then we're kind of centrally located as far as reaching other patients from Larkspur, Monument, uh, even Friendtown, Elizabeth, even as far as Kiowa. Right. So we're right. And then the third reason really was kind of a feeling of wanting to get back to a simpler, slower pace of the feeling of um, a small town dental practice. Right, yes. right. Well, how often should people see a dentist? Once every six months is what we recommend for cleanings, um, x rays, uh, exams. And Keep then, an eye on things. That's right. And then, unless you have periodontal disease, then we recommend every three months or so. Right. Well, are there uh, foods that are good to eat uh, for t uh, teeth health or things to avoid? Well, that's a great question because we get that question a lot, actually. Um, there's not one food in particular that you say, okay, if I eat this, my teeth are always going to be healthy. But you want just kind of a well-balanced, nutritious diet. But on the flip side, there are things that are definitely bad for your teeth, like sugary drinks or uh, coffee with sugar and cream. But even, it, you know, a lot of people don't realize that even healthy foods do have sugars in them. For example, milk, kids that drink milk before they go to bed should brush their teeth before they go to bed because the sugar in the milk can also break down their teeth. So they should brush their teeth after the milk. Yes, correct. Yeah, yes, yes. that makes sense. That mm -hmm. makes sense. So uh, what's the best way for people to contact you? We have a website, uh, castlerockdentalhealth.com. Our phone number is 303-663-9600. Uh, we have an email, admin at castlerockdentalhealth.com. 
Well, excellent. If there's one thing out there that you'd like the general public to know about your uh, dental practice, what would that be? We have an in-house membership program. So if you don't have uh, dental insurance, uh, you pay a standard fee for the year that includes your cleanings, uh, exam and x-rays, and then you get 20% off all services. And wow. also we have great parking. Oh, that's great. Yeah, I noticed I didn't have any problems finding parking out front at all. Yes. Excellent. Well, it's been a pleasure, Linda. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Absolutely. And now this is Dave Gardner with Keller Williams Real Estate. And if you would like your business interviewed for the Park Bench website of LarksburgColorado.com, click on the link below or give me a call at 303-681-1000. Thank you.